you were here again in Tanzania. Uh, the last time you were here for Simba, now you're here for Young. First of, of, uh, first of all, we just want to know uh, you are coming here, uh, which purpose exactly you are coming here. Uh, first of all, thank you very much for the opportunity to speak for the first time after I've resigned from uh, my previous club. Um, it has been a great journey. I've enjoyed every moment. Uh, I've enjoyed every part of it. It was exciting for me, but of course it has its own challenges. So, you know, as a professional that I am, uh, if, if, if you don't feel uh, comfortable anymore and you don't see eye to eye and uh, things are not, uh, you know, you're no longer aligned. So the best thing to do is to move on. So I know that uh, it came as a shock, but it was not something that has happened overnight. It's something that has been building up, you know. So as a person that I am, I respect institution. I, res I respect uh, Simba Sports Club as an organization. And as such, I will keep it that way. I wish them all the best. I know that they've got a chance this coming season to do even well in CAF Champions League. So I wish them well. Some of them, uh, or Simba first, they are saying that you are, you are a betrayer because uh, they trusted you a lot. And you are now saying that they are, we should start uh, growing uh, gradually until you have decided to leave Simba, uh, 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 Tanzania. Perhaps they just want to know what exactly made you to leave Simba and join the, the arrival here. First of all, let me explain something that I didn't uh, leave my previous club to go and join her rivals. Mm -hmm. I left my club because we're no longer in alignment. We're no longer seeing things the same way. Mm -hmm. I had my issues. And as a professional, you know, you must respect an institution. You know, if you're no longer happy and you cannot resolve some of the issues you're having, the best thing is to move on. You know, as I'm saying that, I, mean, I wish them all the best. You know, I don't have uh, any gripes about them. You know, I wish them everything of the best. The only thing that I cry for is their supporters and the fans. I'm very sorry. You know, it's part of life, you know, and um, as much as they have their feelings about me, it's okay, it's part of life. You know, football for me, is, it's, it's a career. Football for me, it's work. Football for me, it's uh, something that I make a living out of, you know, and uh, it's like you, even yourself. If you're not happy where you are, you will move on, mm -hmm. you know. So, so, so I've made that decision, and it's my decision, and uh, I would not want to go back to that, you know. Today, I'm excited coming to Tanzania to come and take up a new role in a, in a, in a, in a new club. Um, so I'm, I'm excited about that. This uh, very morning, uh, one of the, the, your previous CEO, uh, I mean, uh, Chairperson, uh, Mohamed Doj, was interviewed and said that uh, one of the responsibilities that he brought you for, it was just the, uh, the maximizing of the profit of the club and minimizing the cost. And perhaps you didn't uh, attain uh, uh, that uh, objective. And you have now joined Yanga. Can you respond on that one? Or did, did uh, the chairman say that? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Let me respond to that. I didn't expect it to be to be like that. I don't expect uh, to have a go of words between myself and my previous club. It's unfair to say that. You know, when I joined the club, uh, we had sat down with uh, with the executive and uh, the board of directors. We sat down to approve the budgets. So if you say that I did not achieve that, it's it's unfair. You know, my last report that I submitted to the board shows that I've achieved it. I've, I've, I've worked under the budget. I've saved some, kind of, some, some couple of uh, 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 shillings in the same budget. So when you're saying that I have not cut costs, what do you mean? It's not fair. That's why I'm saying I don't like to be professional. I don't want to comment about my previous club. You know, if the, the chairperson has, uh, has such comment, it's unfair. Because the report that he has on his table will prove him contrary to what he's saying to, to the public. You know, it's not true, you know. Uh, we, were, we, were, we were already on a process of uh, um, setting up our commercial branches throughout the country. We're in a process of doing a number of things uh, with, the, with, the, with the club. You cannot go into a club and uh, start by making money. You can't start by doing that. You need to, to build a foundation. You need to ensure that the foundation is proper. Make sure that the systems are in place. Make sure that uh, for the following season we are able now to move. So we are in that process. Unfortunately, I could not go on because we had our fundamental uh, differences, which I didn't agree with. You know, but it's unfair. Mm -hmm. Like you are telling me that the chairperson has said that on radio, mm -hmm. it's unfair. Mm -hmm. The report in front of him mm -hmm. will prove him contrary. Okay. Uh, now we are in a window of registration. And there have been uh, so many discussions that um, one of the, uh, the, the registration you did when you were in Simba was the Luis Mixon, and you facilitated the, the, the issue. And most of the people, they are saying that Luis Mixon, 
he's not uh, uh, a Simba a player for the five years. You are the one who uh, did that. Can you verify the uh, the contract of Simba and Luis Mixon? Luis' uh, contract is very tight with Simba. Luis Mixon is a Simba player. When I was uh, at the club, we did a deal. Even that deal itself it has all his own issues. You know, it was a long struggle to get him on, 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 on to the club. But to, 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 to not speak on behalf of the, my previous club, I'm not speaking on behalf of them. I'm speaking on behalf of myself as a person that was involved in the deal. Uh, Louis Mikizon is a Simba Sports Club player for three and a half years. Okay. And now you are in Yanga. What uh, should Yanga fans expect from you? As Because we know that in Yanga there is uh, nothing uh, in, the, in their constitution. They don't have uh, a CEO uh, position. Uh, what is your responsibility? Generally, that you've been here. I think uh, maybe let me take this opportunity to try and close the issue of Simba. Mm -hmm. You know, it was not nice. It was a difficult decision to make to to, to leave the club. Mm -hmm. So as much as whatever has happened and people are commenting the way they are commenting, mm -hmm. it's unfair. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to go back to, to 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 the records and go back to the facts. You know, it's very very unfair. You know, I would like to close that picture. I had good times with the club. I've achieved with the club. It was good to be with the club. That chapter is closed. Mm -hmm. I have moved on now. I moved on to assist uh, 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 young Africans, mm -hmm. you know, and you know all the issues around the uh, constitution and all those issues. Of course, we sat down and discussed them and see how best uh, my role will be. And uh, I would rather prefer the club to pronounce on that. Mm -hmm. You know, I am not employing myself. Mm -hmm. I'm being employed, so it's best for the club to to clarify my role, which I understand very well. And I know what my role is going to be, but I think it's best uh, in respect of, 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 of the citizens that they make that announcement. Uh, younger fans, they trust that you are the one who is facilitating now the, we, uh, the registration that is taking place in Yanga. One of them is now uh, the coming of Trisila Kisinda and Tunombe Moko. Are you the one? No, no, let's, let's, let's give credit where it's due. I think uh, a Yanga has got a, a very good group of people that are working behind the, the scenes people that are working very hard to ensure that the club is ready for next season. Uh, so it's very, very uh, improper for people to start, to start saying it's Senzo, no, it's not Senzo. Mm -hmm. It's younger people headed by the, 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 the sponsors, GSM, headed by the chairman himself, Sam Sola. You know, they were a group of uh, strong people that are working behind the scenes. Of course, now and then you advise where you can because I just, I just came in now, you know. But we must give credit to you. They're doing a fantastic job. You know, uh, they consult now and then, but the work that they've been doing is it's, it's amazing. So we must look forward to a very exciting VPL league. And uh, I'm, 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 I'm very excited that uh, this uh, season is going to be fireworks. You know, so credit to them. And I think um, they've managed to, to bring in good quality into, into the club. Ionic question. You are from Simba to Yanga. If you feel uh, good, will you go back sometimes uh, to coming to Simba again? Uh, I never regret my decisions. When I make my decision, I move on and I live with the consequences. So I don't think that they will be coming back. Okay. One question to Sam. How long did you take to do this decision to move from Simba to Yanga? Again, I did not move from Simba to Yanga. My, my decision was to go back home and see what would come. But I don't know how the, the other guys had that, uh, you know, I'll be leaving. So we started talking as well. So it's not been an easy decision. It's, it, it, it took some time. It took some time. No, he's saying that you moved from Simba to Yanga. But he's saying that way because when you announced that you have re retired to, from Simba, just evening, just oh. real time. Uh, no, no, it's, it's, it's look, we, see, we saw some pictures. Look, it's, uh, it's, yeah, it's, it's, some, it's part of football. I mean, I mean, I mean. Do do you think that I can just, uh, you know, it's a, it's a bold decision? But do you think I can just make that decision without securing my future? Let's be honest to each other. I secure my future, then I move on. But there are some uh, leaders from Yanga that were coming to you and asking you to go back to Yanga. No. Was it your decision that now I'm from Simba, I'm going to Yanga? It was my decision that I will move on to the next available job. So your job uh, just uh, uh, entered to Yanga. I was looking for Yanga. I was looking forward to a, my next available job, and it happened to be Young Africans. You mean that Yanga gave you the most green pastel? We'll see about that. For now, it's in a challenge. You know, one thing that you must understand that uh, being a, 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 a successful with the club like we were with Simba, 
it's not going to be an easy decision to go to a club that has not done well all these years. You know, we know the, the, the history of, 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 of young Africans. For the past three seasons, it's been difficult. They've not won anything, you know. Um, there's been rumbles in the, in, the, in the club, you know, they've been lacking some consistency. You know, somebody will ask, but why would Senzo go and, and join a club? Those are the challenges that I appreciate most because my expertise, my worth, my, my, my skills will be appreciated, you know. Maybe people will allow me to assist in, in reshaping the club and uh, we can move forward together. Of course, I'm not going to do this job alone, you know. There's an ex existing executive committee which is uh, led by Chairman Msola himself. There's a support from uh, GSM through Engineering Hesse. Uh, there's support from other sectors of, 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 of the club. So it's not going to be an easy uh, ride, but these are the challenges that uh, I thrive under. You were a CEO, that means you are the main person who knows almost everything in terms of application when you're in Simba. Uh, will you use, as an, uh, because you know now the secrets of the Simba uh, Sports Club was when you were a CEO, will you use this one as a weapon? to challenge Simba when you, you are here in Yanga? The best way to challenge uh, any other club in the VPL is to go and win in the matches. There's no other way. So these other politics and gossips I'm not interested in. My interest is go to the pitch, make sure we've got a strong club, I mean strong team, make sure we've got a strong technical bench, make sure the operations in the office are better, and then we we'll go and challenge. These are the things about weapons, and if I don't believe in that. The only weapon we need is in the field of play. Your word to younger fans? Um, I need your support, uh, I'm there to serve you and I'm very excited to be a member of Monanchi. And the other side? Which side? Simba. I've moved on my brother. All right. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Come on, 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 Come on